Hey, today on Steamed Culture, I have something extremely hot. Stay tuned, right here. Hey, I'm Brent, you're watching Steam Culture. Welcome back to our longtime viewers. Thank you very much for being there for us each and every week. Welcome. If you're a new viewer, hang around, become a longtime viewer. We're gonna do that by sending out content each and every Friday, showing you where steam and culture meet. There's an intersection there. So, uh, I got some good news and some bad news. The good news is 2020 is over. The bad news is there's a super huge volcano below Yellowstone Park that could erupt and cover the whole country in molten rock and ash. A little thing like that. But after 2020, I think we can manage it. Now, I'm not kidding. There actually is a super volcano, as they call it, below uh, Yellowstone Park, where old, guy, uh, old Faithful hangs out, the geyser that's you know really popular. There's a pool of magma, 250 billion cubic feet of this molten magma. And apparently, when it gets too hot, the, uh, the lava thins out and rises to the surface. And if that thing blows, the envelope, as they call it, of ash and molten rock that it's going to cover is ginormous. So they have this idea that they are going to drill the largest underground wells in history, 10 kilometers deep. Now here's the idea. They need to cool it down so that it doesn't rise to the top. So they're gonna pump cool water down around a perimeter around all this hot, Lava. It's going to cool the rocks, which will in turn cool the lava, which in turns will make it behave and stay where it's supposed to behave. Why am I telling you all this on steam culture? Because all that cold water making contact with that rock, it's going to heat up, vaporize, and turn to steam, which they will then pump out of the ground and use the steam to turn generators and produce power for tens of thousands of people in that region. So. Pretty cool. It'd be really cool if it didn't blow up, for starters, but it'd be really cool if you can make some steam out of it. So, uh, I don't know if they're ever, ever going to do this. These are very smart people sitting around thinking about what they would do. So, I appreciate if they would do it if they think it's going to blow up. That's what I wish for. So, what I also wish for is that you go find us online because we have great content each and every week, including super volcanoes that may or may not blow up in the next 600,000 years. Stay tuned for something next week. See ya.